Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing absolutely brilliant. As you know, my endeavor has always been to improve on the quality of my reviews and how we can look at things because all these things are actually the stuff that I myself put in my body. And I would definitely like people to be aware of what are the things they put in their body. Whenever we buy supplements, we have these questions in our mind that whether it's Nutrimed, as it is, Muscle Blaze, or even Grizzly or Sinew, whatever it is that we put, what are the things that they're putting in the products? Many times you see arguments whether they put a lot of additives, it's not way, they've added certain things. Sometimes they add carbs, which is sometimes fine, but sometimes they add a bunch of additives like um, food additives, sometimes they add maldextrin or stuff like that. The only way we could find out whether they have put something or not either through the label, and if they don't tell it in the label, then we kind of depend on the brand value and trust whatever they say that they're putting in the system. But I believe that I found a way in which I myself can be assured whether they're putting certain extra things in the products or they're at all giving us whey protein or not at a level that not even these companies have ever imagined that someone's going to find out. For this beginning of a series of video, I'm introducing Nutrimed Muscle Whey as it is raw whey isolate and Muscle Blaze Beginner's Protein products, how different they are under a microscope. To it, I'm going to mark this piece of paper with different areas and name them differently. So this one is for nutrient, one is low, is for and one below that is for muscle Add the stuff into the circles. Because it's a microscopic test, we just need a wee bit of the sample. Here goes muscle blaze. All right. So just for understanding, first one I'm repeating is Nutrimed. It's 70% protein. Then we have as it is nutrition, which is like whey isolate and raw. There's no additive, not enzyme, nothing. So it's the purest form. And then we have the Muscle Blaze Beginner's Way, which is like 50% protein. Now let's put these things under this USB micro microscope. So we'll start with Nutrimed. Here's how it looks under the microscope. Nutrimed. It's like sand type of, you know, that's how it looks at least. Now we'll move on and we'll kind of brush off the surface and we'll move to as it is way. Here's how as it is way looks like under the microscope. We'll try to do a bit more of a zooming action, but that's how it looks like. It's more like a pure whitish milk powderish thing. Now we're looking at the Muscle Blaze Beginner's Way and we're starting to see different things in here. I'll try to do a different type of focus, but to begin with, I'll try to put the markers on the screen, but uh, I think what you can see is there are some plasticky or something. I'm not sure. It's not plastic, perhaps. There are certain things which are reflecting light more than the others. These are like you can see now on the screen this thing is reflecting way too much light it's some sort of a crystal and the granules are much finer than the other two products that we just checked what else we got okay there's this this different thing in here see the tr the color of this thing is a bit yellowish it's got so much different additives man i mean this thing is full of additives check this out see do you see this there's this yellow chunk of something and around it this uh, grayish color stuff. So I think what we're looking at is definitely some additive, some binder sort of thing like maltodextrin or soy lexitine. I'm not sure. Again, same stuff. It's everywhere, this additive. I don't know what this thing is, but they've added like a bunch of this thing. Let me see if I can zoom in and find out a bit more about it. Yes, a wee bit better. If you see the granules that are around this thing, these are like the way or something that we saw previously in in this uh, 
my protein uh, as it is protein and nutrient protein but this thing is entirely different see I'll just repeat this one is muscle blaze beginners way and it's got all these bunch of things if I just move on to as it is quickly quick and dirty and do the focus action there see there's not much it's just very simple stuff right it's some nice binding but there's just one single type of thing there's not much two three different type of structures that you see do you see that no I don't think right this is simple one structure however I do have to stay say as it is does have something which reflects light a lot more check it out do you see that there are places where the light is reflecting too much I'm not sure if these crystals are there's supposed to be any crystal or not but it's reflecting light I don't know what it is now if we dirty and quick and dirty move to nutrient now here's something interesting it's got you can see right it's got certain things which are like those beginners way black dots I think those are colors because this thing is also flavored stuff but apart from that everything is more or less there are some yellow dots though there's small yellow dots but that's very less the rest of it is just the same structure as the as it is and some of the structure of um, beginners way I think this is how whey protein looks like because I just put this thing before uh, this video I, I put it in a few of the other whey proteins that I got and this is exactly how the structure is which is predominant in case of now again see here there is this some crystal type of thing I found it everywhere uh, I, I searched the internet I didn't find see what I'm talking about this one I searched the internet and I never found that nobody's saying that there should be any crystal or light reflecting too much light reflecting stuff in any of whey protein if it's in pure so even the pure one has it and it's kind of have it everywhere if you look at it see see you can see right it's, it's just reflecting all over small small reflections and uh, nutrient has it I just showed it to you and the biggest dominant thing is this uh, beginners way oh my god look at this chunk look at this chunk see what the hell is this thing see and this yellow strips I think the yellow is a binder I understand that because all the whey protein is kind of surrounding it but what are these crystals so I don't know I'll try to gather more info about it and maybe make a different video if anyone has any more info about this please let me know but under the microscope all these proteins from India they're having some sort of crystal stuff in there what I got to do I think is the next course of action is compare these with any of the brands coming from US uh, mostly isolate or something and see if they also have it then we'll get to know that something they're adding they're all adding or maybe whey protein has that stuff you really want more this type of review because I'm gonna bring a lot more of these comparison videos under the microscope and we get to know what all things these people put in the products that we consume but let me know what your view is do you think it's useful please let me know and that encourages me beyond anything and I'll be pumped to make more videos like this until next time have an awesome life folks ciao